Hey, how's it going guys? Zodar here and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video and uh, today I'm going to show you guys how to enable higher resolutions such as 2144, I think that's what it is, or uh, 4K which is 3860 by 1080 I want to say. Don't, uh, don't hate me if I got that wrong. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. But uh, I had to redo this video because apparently Far Cry 4, I don't know if it's because it was at 4K or uh, Far Cry 4 just does not want to play nice with OBS. I don't know which one it is because uh, Far Cry 4 just uh, would not work because it wouldn't go into full screen. Just nothing was working right. So uh, we're going to use Battlefield 4 instead. I know Battlefield 4 is like uh, sort of the end all be all for benchmarks, but uh, we'll go ahead and use that just because of the fact that I can't get Far Cry 4 to run. So yeah. So what you're gonna want to do is uh, right click uh, on your desktop, make sure you have the GeForce Experience installed, click on NVIDIA Control Panel, click on Manage 3D Settings, mine's already on it. You want to uh, look at this option right here, DSR uh, Factors. I don't know if it supports all GPUs. Uh, make sure that you have more than enough frames to run it though, because uh, if you if you have, let's say, like, uh, if you're barely getting 60 FPS on 1080p with Ultra or whatever settings you play on, you're not going to be able to play on 2160, 44, or 66. I don't know what it is, but, um, yeah, you can't play that or 4K. It just doesn't work. So what you're going to want to do is uh, just select all of these, or, well, select whichever ones are relevant to you. If you want to just enable them all, you can. Uh, this is 4K, obviously. Um, this is the 2144, whatever it is. But, uh, yeah, go ahead and click Apply. Um, you'll see your screen flash, but, yeah, that's normal. And uh, this right here, DSR Smoothness, uh, you don't really need to mess with this unless you know what you're doing. Um, people say that the the best two to leave it at is either 33, which is the default. Uh, I wouldn't recommend going any higher than 33. But uh, if you want to do your, if you want to do some testing, uh, people also say that uh, 25 to around 27 to 28 works good as well. So you can try that out if you want. But uh, once you have that, you're just going to go ahead and open up whatever game you want to try it in. Again, I'm just going to use Battlefield 4, just because I know beat it to death with the benchmarks. But um, it's just the best thing that should work. <laughs> so uh, I'm just going to go ahead and click play now. And uh, if you're wondering what hardware I'm running on, um, I am running on an i7-4790K and a GTX 970. Okay, so I am now back. Um, this is Battlefield 4 running on my PC at 4K. This is the resolution I'll show you right now. It is 3840 by 2160. And... Uh, I can tell you right now that this is not playable for me at least on this well eh, all right let, let's give it that it's playable it, it's a little bit choppy but uh, I'm getting at least a constant 30 frames per second so I mean I guess if then like there's dips sometimes so like if you if you absolutely have to play it you can if you want to play it 4k or if you have uh, more capable hardware uh, like maybe uh, 980 I don't know if, uh, how well a 980 runs it but if you uh, were to go to like maybe uh, SLI 970s you might be able to run it I'm not sure but uh, let's see how it does with the explosion it, me personally when it goes when it goes into these higher resolutions I don't even really see that much of a like uh, graphical difference um, if I was you and and if you want like higher resolution, more sharper textures, uh, but you still want to maintain a playable frame rate, uh, I would recommend. Uh, I don't know if there's. I don't know if 2K is a thing, but yeah, uh, 2144 by. I want to say 1460, or yeah, I I want to say, but um, here I'll go ahead and uh, I'll enable that real fast, and I'll come right back. 